Two princess sisters taking a break from the road. Two princess sisters return to their old home. Celestia, stop singing. What? I'm just so excited to be back at Cantalot Castle. It's been, uh, how many years? Ten to be exact. Oh, we're back in our Cantalot home after a long road trip with my favorite sister. Um, only sister? And remember, this isn't our home anymore. Twilight Sparkle's the new ruler now, so we can't exactly treat this place like it's home. All right, Buzzkill. Now come on, let's go in. <sighs> it's good to be back, though, and we'll see our friend Twilight. We're home! Celestia, I keep telling you, this isn't our home anymore. All right, well, I did pick out the decor in this room and I see it hasn't changed, so technically a bit of us is still here. Yeah, quite a bit. Huh? Intruders! Huh? Hmm? Huh? What are you ponies doing in Princess Twilight Sparkle's home? Get out! Uh, okay, Rouge, you must be new here. We're the princesses that used to live in Cantalot Castle, Princess Luna and Princess Celestia. Uh, we used to rule over Equestria. Hello? Hey, I'm not new here. I started five years ago, but your names do sound familiar. Is ten years really all it takes for ponies to forget about us? I'm not having this. Where's Twilight Sparkle? Princess Twilight Sparkle is in the throne room doing her royal duties. Not that it's any of your business. But uh, I mentored her. Look, can you just go let Princess Twilight know that Luna and Celestia are here? Huh. Okay, but you two stay right there. The audacity of some ponies. Yeah, I gotta say, the guards are on point though. We're not royalty here anymore, Celestia. Twilight is. Huh, I suppose. It'll be nice to see her though. Yeah, I wonder how she's taking to her new royal life. Uh, not very new, it's been 10 years. Which is a very short amount of time for alicorns. True. I wonder if she'll look any different. Huh, I don't know, I suspect she'll look the same. I can't wait to tell her about all our trips over Equestria. She'll love it. Ahem. <clears throat> oh, you. Did you speak to Twilight Sparkle? I mean, Princess Twilight Sparkle? Yes. She'll see you now. Follow me. Charming. Princess Twilight, this is Luna and Celestia. <gasps> wow, wait, this can't be. Celestia, Luna, I can't believe you guys are here. What? What a surprise, you guys. Uh, Twilight, is that you? It is. I guess 10 years can change a pony a lot. Oh. Twilight, how wonderful! You've grown into a beautiful alicorn princess. We look so alike, we could be twins. That's very flattering, Celestia, but I could never look as gorgeous as you. <laughs> oh, you. But, but I... I... I don't understand what... Uh... Luna, it's great to see you. What's wrong? Oh, maybe she's a bit travel sick. I am a bad driver. <laughs> oh yes, you need to tell me all your stories of traveling around Equestria. It has been 10 years. You must have so much to tell me. And same to you, ruler of Equestria. We need to know everything about how you've been doing with royal duties. <laughs> Luna, why are you not talking? What the f Luna, that's not very royal of you. Uh, Twilight, what the f is that? <laughs> Luna! Oh my god, Luna, stop! It's not fair! It's oh, not fair. I need backup! The princess is being attacked! <laughs> Luna, it's been an hour now and you still haven't said anything. Hmm. Luna, the princess has very kindly let us stay after you attacked her for no reason. She's even given us chamomile and honey tea to calm you. Tell me what's wrong! If I tell you why I attacked our good friend, you'll laugh at me. No, I won't. Hmm. I think you at least owe me and Twilight an explanation. She's taller than me. What? Ten years in the throne. She's already taller than me. Same height as you, actually. Okay. And that warrants an attack on the princess because... 
I am short. I have always been the shortest princess. Even Cadence is a few inches taller than me. Okay. We're so much older than them, Celestia. You're older than me by like four years. How come you're so much taller than me? I don't know, it's just alicorn things. Every pony always preferred you and thought you were more powerful than me. All because you were the big sister and quite literally the bigger sister. Are you calling me fat? No. Dare I say it, I think I'm more powerful than Twilight and yet I'm not taller than her. I'm not nearly as intimidating. Every villain we fight always sees me as the weakest link because of that. But you grew taller when you came out of the moon. And yet I'm still not tall enough. Why can't I be a magnificent alicorn with big wings like you and Twilight? It's not fair. Oh, Luna, come here. Baby sister. No, I'm not a baby. That's my point. Well, you knew our dad was a short king. Yeah, and because of that, I'm the short princess. Watch. Flurry Heart in just a couple of years will be taller than me. Oh, don't be silly. Let's just go to Twilight and explain everything. She must be terrified of you. Oh. Oops. Um, hi, Twilight. <gasps> I tried to stop them, Your Majesty, but they have some powerful magic for ordinary ponies. But ordinary ponies? We used to be the rulers of the soil you're standing on, young man. Uh, it it's okay, Soren. You can leave. Right. I'll be outside. Your royal guards have serious attitude problems. Yeah, well, they're not the only ones. Sorry for my outburst earlier, Twilight. I don't know what came over me. It's alright, Luna. You didn't hurt me. I'm just concerned. Is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Tell her. Ugh. Okay, I may or may not have gotten jealous. Jealous? Of me? Whatever for? Your height. Oh, I, I did think about that, to be fair. See, she's not the only one that thought it. Every pony knows I'm the short princess, and now ponies feel sorry for me. Well, I didn't expect to be growing as tall as Celestia by now, because, you know, you and Cadence are kind of short. I thought I'd stay short. Mm. Yeah, I can see I'm not helping. Well, I wish I was your height, Luna. Look at you. You're so cute, little cutie pie. Uh, what did I say? Where do you think you're going? I'm leaving, loser. Huh? Zakora the Zebra? What on earth are you doing here? Hello, Luna, Princess of Night. You seem in a hurry. Is everything alright? Yeah, um, I'm okay, I think. Luna, do not bother with your lies. I can see that's not the truth through your eyes. Oh, damn you and your perfect rhyme, Sakura. I went to go see Twilight after 10 years, and I realized that she's so much more taller and prettier than I ever was on the throne, and I'm upset because I feel threatened by it. I wish I was as tall as my sister. I wish I was as tall as Twilight. That's it. Hmm. Uh, what are you doing? Hearing your wishes made me think. Maybe your problems will be solved after this drink. Think of the height you wish to be. Then this potion will make you match it perfectly. Really? A, a potion for heights? It may sound silly, but this will work, my filly. Trust in Zakora potion bubbles, or carry on with your troubles. Makes no difference to me. Okay, fair enough. Now I'm off to see the princess. I hope this potion solves your stress. Huh. I hope so, too. Oh, Sakura, you brought the potions I requested. Thank you. No problem, Princess Twilight. I hope I find you all right. But the Princess Lunar outside had a mare. Would either of you seem to care? Oh, you saw my sister. Did she run off outside? I may have given her a potion for her small problem, but I doubt it will help her forever in the long run. Wait, you gave Luna a potion for her height? Luna, what have you done? I'm tall, baby. Ah, uh, yes. My potion was a success. Whoa, uh, Luna, I... Uh, I didn't think you would... Didn't think I could be better than you? Well, looky here. Luna, our heights don't make us better than each other. Uh, yeah, right. Easy for you to say. You didn't need a potion to grow to the height that you're at. Luna, you're being ridiculous. You wouldn't think that if you had a day in my hooves. Being the short sister, the little baby sister. You guys have no idea. You're right. 
We don't. Sakura, do you have another one of those potions? I do indeed, my noble steed. Sakura, your rhymes are not making sense now. Shut up, buttercup. Huh? Here you are, my majesty. Another one made successfully. Thank you very much, Sakura. Are you seriously gonna try and be taller than me now? Huh? Hi. Ooh, ooh. Huh. Princess Twilight, you made yourself shorter? Yeah, I realized I didn't know what it was like in your hoof, so I made myself the height you, well, used to be. Cause I'm confident I can still rule Equestria, tall or not. Just like you already did, Luna. You didn't need to be tall like me. Wait, but you're not actually gonna stay like that, are you? Well, you were planning to stay tall, weren't you? Why can't I stay short? Because now you're not as powerful. Nope, I'm as powerful as I've always been. Right, Sakura? The potion I made does not affect your magic. To think it would so, it's pretty tragic. All right, Sakura, I don't know the ins and outs of potions. <sighs> Let's change back. Luna, really? But you finally got the height you wanted. Yeah, but it's just not me. Twilight's right, it doesn't affect how powerful I am or my magic, or my abilities that I had to be a leader. I did everything you did, Celestia, but half your height. That's pretty cool. Yes, exactly. Okay, good, because this is just freaky. Well, thanks for visiting, you guys. It certainly was eventful. <laughs> Yeah, sorry about all that. Now that I know you ponies' faces, I'll know your trouble. Oh yeah? And what are you gonna do about it? Be very stern and tell you to go away. You wanna go, mate? You wanna go? Celestia, stop. It's a pity you're going now. Flurry Heart and Cadence are supposed to be coming around for tea. Oh, we'll catch them another time, I'm sure. Yes, I think we need to head off. Alrighty. Hey guys, it's been ages since we've seen you. Look at my baby, all grown up. Hey guys. <laughs> Flurry heart? Yep. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. 